Major, how long does it take you to, to train up in one of these fighters, and, and not just to, to fly it, but to fight with it? The amount of time is pretty extensive, and I think that's one of the things that maybe the, the general population doesn't know. From the time you enter into pilot training to the point where you're combat mission ready, uh, what pilots call CMR, it can take as long as two and a half years. Mm. Uh, so you will start from the very basics of aviation, not even talking about combat, and you'll just learn formation flying, uh, some instrument flying, and what it is to go from point A to point B. From there, there's a graduated step up where you'll start doing uh, low-level flying. Uh, really, before your combat mission ready, it takes an extensive amount of flight training. Uh, but the other thing that isn't taken into account is the months and months of ground training that also goes into it. You're talking about things like combat training. Uh, you're talking about resistance training. Uh, a lot of folks that go and fly in places like Alaska have to go through Arctic survival training mm -hmm. and even water survival training. So those months add up as well. All being told, you're probably looking at about three years from the point that you enter to the point that you graduate and you're ready to step uh, into a combat environment as a combat mission-ready wingman.